Asalaamu As Alaikum everyone. So today I'm sharing a day in Ramadan where I'm sharing a grocery haul and how I organized my fridge. I hope you enjoyed this video and don't forget to give my video a thumbs up and subscribe. So first I wake up in the morning and use the bathroom and do wazoo and then I come downstairs and do a tahajjud. And after praying I go to the kitchen and take out what I'm going to be eating for suhoor. For sehri, I'm having some bindi gosh and some naan and my water here. So bindi is like the messiest way to eat it. Go good. Assalamu alaikum guys, good morning. So as you guys just saw, it's about 6 a.m. and I just did my sehri and prayed and read some Quran. Now I'm just going to outside to get some groceries actually. So, um, the grocery store is open like 6 a.m. so everybody's sleeping. So I just thought I will go before the kids school start. So let's go. I thought I'll just take you guys along today. It is so foggy outside. and. Um, it is 46 degrees outside right now. So I'm just gonna back up my car. Let's go. I cannot see my windshield. I should have something on. Okay guys, so I'm back from the grocery store and let me show you what I got from today. So I got these sweet Hawaiian burgers for some salmon burgers I got from Costco last week. So I'm going to be using that for that. And I also got this um, Dave's Killer white bread. And then here are some chips that we like to eat, the Cape Cod ones. And then must smell like these pretzel goldfish, so I got those. And here's some romaine lettuce, potatoes, and here's some Dijon mustard, and got some um, chickpeas with low sodium. These were like 79 cents at Giant right now. So I grabbed a couple of those, and I also grabbed some dark kidney beans. And then here is some ranch that was also on sale, so I got two. And then some cucumbers and here's some eggs and then here's some beets I got for some juicing and then here's some jalapenos um, I also found this sunscreen for the kids and then I, I got this yogurt um, these were two for seven so I got two of them and then Amna loves these dill pickles so I got those here is some M&M yogurt. And I also want to make some avocado egg rolls. So I got these sun-dried tomatoes for that. And then here's some apple juice and milk, popcorn. In my house, everybody's a popcorn lover. And some Coke. I also got some carrots for juicing. And here's some mint. And I also got some cilantro. And then I also got this fridge and freezer baking soda because mine were expiring. So I got two of those. And two apples. And um, there's some cheesecake. The Belgium chocolate cheesecake. My kids love these. So I got this for the giant as well. And here's some grapefruits. Tomato on the wine. And then I also went to Target's. So I got some Marilax from there. Um, this Tom's anti-plaque and whitening toothpaste. And I also got this Unicorn Sparkle Bubblegum flavor. 
for the kids. They like that toothpaste. And I also found this pill case. And this was $3 for my vitamins and stuff like that. I also got this broom and a brush and got some command hooks. And I got these two water bottles as well. These were like 15% off at Target Circle. So I got two of them. One for Mustafa. He needed one and I needed one. So I got one for myself. And then I got this Scrub Daddy. These are dye free and I like using them. So I got two of this one. And I got two of the Scrub Mommy. So on this side is soft and the other side is a little bit hard. And then I also found these latex free gloves from Mr. Clean. So I got those to try it. So here's the other Scrub Mommy. And I also found this disinfectant fabric and air freshener by Odo Ban. So I thought I'll give this a try and it says it kills 99.0% germs. I needed a disinfectant spray, so I got that. And a Lysol thing. So kids schools have started and Mustafa requested to eat some fruit roll of cereal for today. So I'm gonna give that to him. And here is an egg for Amna. She wanted to eat her spicy egg with green chilies in it. So kids are just gonna take their class and eat their breakfast. And while they're taking it, I will just put all the groceries away now. So here's my bread box. I got that from Amazon and like to keep my bread in there. So now I'm just putting the burger buns, bagels, and the tortilla bread on there. And I put that on top of my fridge. And now I'm just organizing my eggs. Um, I like to sort my old eggs in the front so we use them first and then the new eggs at the back. And then I like to put the Dave's Killer Bread in the fridge because I feel like when I put it in the container, um, it goes bad really fast than the other breads I used to use before. So I just like to keep it in the fridge. And then I'm just gonna, um, I already washed these cucumbers and I'm placing a paper towel under it so it doesn't go bad super fast. So, And um, for the cilantro, I just like to wrap it in a towel because it stays much fresher that way and it does not go bad. And same thing for the mint, I like to place it in a container with the paper towel underneath it. And then in my fruit basket, I just like to take out all my old fruits out first as well and then put the new ones at the bottom. So here in my fridge, I'm just replacing my fridge and freezer baking soda with a new one because it keeps all the odors away and that's why I like to keep one in both of them. In my fridge, I will give you a tour of what's inside. So in the first shelf, I have my yogurt, some strawberries at the top, and I like to keep the avocados in there, and I have eggs there, and my bread. And in this shelf, we just keep our leftovers, and on this one, here's our milk, and I kept my veggies here. So that's the cilantro, celery, here's the mint, and I put the lettuce back there. And then on this shelf, I like to keep my onions, garlic, and ginger in these baskets, lines, and they are from Walmart and Target. And in this drawer, I like to keep my tomatoes in a basket as well, facing down, because I feel like they don't go bad that super fast, and mangoes, cucumbers. And my last basket, I also have another basket there for the kids, for the apples and carrots and cucumbers so they can easily snack on stuff. Also, this is an easy access for the kids so I keep their snacks here, yogurts and cheese here. And on the top, I just have some butter. And the second shelf, I just have all the condiments. And that's it. So now I'm just heading down in my basement to um, get my clothes from the drying rack. So I have been drying my clothes here for about three weeks now because our dryer has not been working. So inshallah it will be coming this Monday. So I got this rack from Amazon to dry all of our clothes. So 
I just thought I would share that with you guys and this is a really I really like this rack if you guys are looking for it I will leave the link down below so I just like to leave the fan on and let the clothes dry for a whole day so I'm just gonna check if all of them are dry and I'm just gonna get them down get the other ones that I washed yesterday night and I'm gonna hang them on the drying rack So when the kids have little breaks in between their classes, they like to just come outside on the deck to play with each other. So today they're just playing with bubbles. And then here I'm just marinating the salmon that I got from Costco uh, with some spices in them. And then my husband's going to be barbecuing it for later on that we're going to be eating it today. And then he also going to be barbecuing the some chicken breast that I put some spices on and he will barbecue that as well. So we also made some steak for Mustafa and here is the salmon that we made. And also here is the chicken breast that we made. Alhamdulillah everything tasted good and after looking at this food my mouth is watering I don't know if your mouth is watering as well so after that I just cleaned up the kitchen and mopped the floor as well and picked up after the kids so I hope you like this video and if you did don't forget to give my video a thumbs up and subscribe guys and I will be doing a question and answer video next time or assumption video so please leave your questions down in the comments and I will answer them next video I'll see you next time